Hello, greetings. Uh, this is me, Zahra Xia on YouTube. Truth Seeker 1 and 2. So, sorry, I'm having difficulty breathing, huffing and puffing. Um, but after this, I have to tell you what my thoughts about this religion and that I really do care for the welfare of the people. Um, it's um, been quite a journey, very painful, um, and things on me. So a little bit that I was attacked today, the same kind of pain in Karachi during sleep I was having. So I don't know who this cruel person is, doesn't stop. Uh, and again, so to, uh, last night, while asleep, pain in the body, parts of the body, excruciating pain. Can't find this person who is sending these uh, things like Star Wars, maybe they're from the sword, electric sword or something, currents coming. Uh, last night, sorry, this is a message from my friend. Um, uh, this uh, video also wasn't working. I had to reboot it. Uh, so there are some obstacles here. My health and sight obstacles. It wasn't going on video. So problems happening. Uh, this doesn't mean this religion is true. I don't know. I have to say this. I'm not prepared. Can never be prepared. Uh, I'm uh, the vibrations inside compelling me. So if I say bad words or something, again a reminder. Please uh, understand. Uh, that uh, I'm under attack and compulsion. Uh, there's no way to stop this energy from making me say bad words. And if uh, I've been so traumatized also, uh, that if a slight disagreement or something on YouTube, very, very sensitive, I become and I start abusing. So, if you have any, I don't know, uh, the experts know this, but you know, I'm helping people out there. And uh, again, I started to uh, listen to some live streams, especially Zafar Heretic. Uh, so I'm, uh, you know, they, uh, they start to attack me comments through in the comment section I've tried to ignore but again and again I cannot I may not be able to ignore so if I start abusing because the crack part you know it's it me in the head uh, how do you call it uh, psychology uh, psychiatric Lee what do you say so Anyways, people are not going to be careful. Uh, they have, I've seen that they can even misuse uh, mentally ill people. So this is not for those who are extremely cruel, cruel, unkind. This is for those Shias who might like some peaceful living, my co-just Shias who never wanted to hurt people. Uh, very, uh, my co-just Shias, even though they, some of them have come down financially, they're still very refined people, very peaceful. <coughs> From the Chagla family, my mother's relatives, and all. So, very refined and they don't hurt others, they don't go, yeah, they don't go out of their way. 
way to hurt others and even financially as we lived in Karadhar, um, very refined people, uh, not uh, crude and all this, very gentle and uh, never wanting to hurt anyone. So this is for those Shias. Um, people like my Koja community, Koja, Ishnashari. Uh, if you, so if you want to be a Shia and uh, you are most well, I mean, it's your decision. I, I'm not going to, sorry, not most welcome. What I mean by this is, um, I uh, actually that you you could say the sarcasm in me, uh, but I really am sick and tired now. Uh, some Shias that have been uh, hurting people. So when I was going through this ex uh, uh, severe pain and all this, I realized that we have to make a global family, something like uh, Dr. Deepak Chopra has done. You know, with him came Oprah Winfrey, started to help us uh, for free online meditations for 21 days. That was really great of uh, Dr. Deepak Chopra reaching out like this. <coughs> now, anything to do with religion, it really gets to me like I was listening to Paramahamsa Vishwananda recently again. Like I want to see because I have the feeling signs that I'm Radha Rani. So he has uh, been singing these kirtans and uh, feels and Jai Radha Rani. So uh, it gets to me that I should also say Jai Parmam Savashwananda. But it hasn't been of much help. Last night I slept in again on <coughs> the attack on me. Uh, so, don't know what this is. Uh, anyhow, uh, the Shias have uh, followed, we followed Hussein, who was oppressed. We felt very, very oppressed. And so, you know, in the ayats also of the Quran, God says to Abraham, my my covenant of leadership and all this doesn't reach the Salimon. So uh, that's why it, it was very hard to get to the Shias. But if you can just for a while, for the sake of research, your own, uh, go through my videos maybe and then contemplate, because we don't want to uh, be worshipping uh, or having this companion that is uh, bad, uh, uh, the oppressor, cruel. <coughs> so I have to show you, I've been trying to show you how deceived we were by even our religious scholars. Sorry to say it this way. Um, and also maybe brainwashed in such a way that, you know, when I was reading this uh, Quran ayat, I realized that um, in this uh, Surah Azab, like take their land and their homes, it wasn't uh, registering. When I again listen to my video audio, I always do this that I again re listen to what I've uploaded so that I can maybe correct something or am I making sense? You see, this is why I have to, not that I love my voice and what I've said. <laughs> there are people who can say it better, much better, but I don't know. I've uh, requested uh, Sal uh, Salatin, Sultan Salatin to, on, uh, actually on uh, Zafar Heretic, ex-Muslims live stream to write about uh, the Bani Kureza tribe, Hawaii maybe, or something like that. I couldn't uh, put there in detail, but like the whole tribe, you know, 800, 600, 600 minimum 
900 maximum. We don't know. This was kept away from us. So I can't remember the name, uh, the no, sorry, the number of Surah Azab verse 26, 27. But it says there, you know, like um, 35. What is it? Sorry. Yeah, so I stumbled upon it when I had challenged myself that night, uh, the day until night is over. So that was the day in the night time I stumbled upon this verse that you can now inherit their land, their homes. So that's why I have to be slow. It may seem to some people like uh, that this is boring and all this, right? Uh, so, but uh, then it's not for you. Um, you want to, uh, look, there are some people who act smart and really very callous, unkind remarks also. I've seen some of them again on YouTube. So, for example, when Sultan Salatin, her masterpiece, she was giving on uh, Abraham and her, his son, uh, Someone was like boring and comments like that, very unkind, rude comments. And here I was like, I was about to break down. Inside I was crying. Like I was like, oh my God, this is, a, a, you know, this is a masterpiece. Her prose on this uh, Abraham and his son sacrifice. Her prose so it's, it wasn't poetry it was like prose and I was crying inside and then I broke down cried actually cried so maybe it was a pro but it uh, prose sorry written or spoken language in its ordinary form without metrical structure. I don't know, but it was a masterpiece. So I, I really encourage people to uh, bring her in the forefront. She has such a, she can really uh, explain and all this in Urdu. I wish she can also do it in English so she can help us out. I'd love to, you know, ask her to help me out in this uh, Shia Islam, for the Shias. And give voice to me and so that we can help Shias to see this because she's very articulate in Urdu. And maybe if she can also do it in Ur English, um, I would love to ask her this, but I'm shy, I've shied off actually. So she can help me in English also. She's a great lady, and she's helped out for the human rights in Pakistan. <clears throat> what I wanted to do, you know, like who interview prostitutes, this is what she was mentioning in her latest interview with uh, Zafar Heretic at Muslim. So, yes, go door to door interview and help them and see it so that uh, they've even brought out like how many kids she's uh, been saying how, 2,000 children abused uh, sexually and all so they have they must have gone door to door or something because or gone to the people who know about this a lot of work in Pakistan I became insane and couldn't do it. So I'm so grateful to her for doing this and God. Although she's an atheist, uh, but I believe in God. Okay, if you, you see deception and treachery and all these things that we were asked to hate what Allah hates and love what Allah loves in our religion, even Shia, I mean, especially this Shia religion. Sunni religion has no standing at all. But you know, there, um, 
extreme as they would come and kill for uh, like all this personal. You see those who, uh, some Arabs here, there is some good point about Arabs in Saudi Arabia also. Although we uh, thought that, <coughs> excuse me, Saudi Arabia was against Shia Islam, right? Iran, Wahhabi, Wahhabism. But even uh, the crown prince is doing his best. So uh, they, at least this, they've realized what it is. It's, uh, they're becoming modern. They want, uh, I don't know, for pro progress. They want progress, economic in every way. And uh, I hope they don't want their people to remain in this narrow-minded thing, religion, getting security from this religion and their narrow-mindedness. It uh, will uh, really have a dangerous, it's uh, bad for these people and bad for the others who live with them. You can see they cannot even have a church. They won't allow anything, anyone, uh, anything else rather than this religion to flourish in their countries. And this is, uh, so as a Shia, as a very open-minded Shia, uh, uh, this is uh, unhealthy, this is dangerous, this is for the people because you see those, they will go back to their countries, those uh, different Christians, minorities who go to Saudi Arabia and work there. Uh, then they go to America. Now they're also leaving Pakistan. A lot of Christians uh, who are uh, who have left Pakistan, I know about this, from uh, the blocks, uh, some Christian bloc I know in Pakistan, a lot of them, majority of them left Pakistan to go to Canada or America, elsewhere. And if they even can go to Europe, they would go to Europe. So it's a very, if I can show you, I mean, I'm now, right now speaking, so you can have a look at the effect it has had this Islam on countries, Muslim countries and others. Narrow-mindedness, uh, emotional security for emotional security. How many people they've killed? God knows what they're doing for this. Allahu Akbar, for God and Rasulullah. Do you see any Christians? Uh, you know, I, I went to a website where they were F Jesus. Like there was another, not even a Muslim saying this, because a Muslim cannot say F Jesus Christ. There's this Yahoo chat room where, yeah. So their own people can say this and they won't. Uh, they will just say, God bless you, bless you, bless you. I mean, it wasn't like when you, the YouTuber Christian Prince, where they time you out, don't say anything to our Jesus otherwise. There's that, uh, they've taken a, a more intense uh, action. That's good, I mean. I guess, but uh, you know, not when, but not when you are, anyways, they, I think Christian Prince and Rob Christian, they have their own reasons, uh, Dr. David would, I would, if I was in their shoes, I don't know what I would have done with the Muslims, like they're going to come and behead me, they've given me life that they should, They've put food on my table in Karachi, these Muslims. Who do you think they are? They've put food on my table? Huh? baat baat pe gang rape kar do. Abhi to nafsa nafsi mein. Udar, ye chal rai. Toys hain kya hum log? Lives are Tum no, tumare baap ne mujhe life di hai kya? Father has given me life. Or put food on my table. Now, for this person, who do you think you are? These people, these Muslims, they think they can, you know, go abroad also and kill, uh, kill these uh, bomb blasts in London. Huh? Tumare bab ka hai kya? 
London. In London, I could uh, work, at least in the college. It was college work, although my UA passport doesn't allow me to be empl employed there. But it was this college thing. So, for a little while, they requested I work there, and they even paid me. Uh, also requesting me and paying me, I thought maybe some Indians can, who were, uh, I was like, they were calling me princess there, princess of Arabia. So, I didn't need this work, but I could work, and what an environment I was given. In that high court, and with working with this Pakistani lawyers and all this. Terrible. They will, you know how much they were paying me for just, my God, in Holborn College? And there, my whole uh, month's salary, working as an intern even, or even those working there for many years to get their license, were not getting, what is like, two weeks, 200 pounds? And, uh, I mean, at that time, and here, a month, what is 200 pounds to, uh, 200 pounds, uh, British pounds, how do you call it, to, not the kg and all this, not those pounds, to Pakistani rupee, PKR. 47,940. Hmm? I got this for just two weeks or one and a half week working. One and a half. 200 pounds. And what was it? College ad admissions. And there was Holborn College. And they even asked me, shall we put it in your bank? I said, you know, I'm leaving and I don't know. Or give you a check or do you want cash in hand so I said cash in hand <laughs> they give me because you know my debit card cash card would only I'm only allowed to take 200 pounds out from that bank I had to f just uh, sorry excuse me uh, so please uh, oh my god And I even told the lawyer that I will need money because my father was from that, that time having financial problems. And uh, yeah, that I will not work for a criminal, but uh, even if, like if it's a criminal case and he's a criminal, I won't work for it. I won't work for him. What am I saying? I'm struggling. I'm struggling to concentrate here. I've got attack on me, watching, feeling. I, my privacy has been completely gone. So if anyone wants to complain that I'm saying things out, uh, uh, I please understand. I've again and again said that my privacy is gone. I don't have a private hour a private moment in my life. I can't. So, do anything without someone having to look at me, pass some commands, this, that, in my thought, telepathically coming to me, communicated to me. Okay, so, this is very, very important. Now, uh, the Shia thing. Please see this. Trying to wake you up. I don't know if you can be able to take action against the criminal things, corruption in Pakistan. But at least get out of this first. Get out of this Islam. Muslims, uh, those, you will remain narrow minded. You won't mix with other people. I'm not saying go out, although there are some Muslims who want to drink and go to parties. 
<clears throat> please these parties and drinking and all the jiddu krishna i love jiddu krishna murti and just saying although he says don't love the person love the what observe and take it from here so some things like you know on fear when you when i read thank god i came across jiddu krishna murti in karachi and i read it was making sense and then you can see so first i'm sorry a uh, prerequisite to this is that because i uh, sorry i got it the hard way i'm trying to give it to you the easy way show you please take the easy way please take my help not like yusuf said he told me over the internet please take my help sir please take my help okay i beg you to take my help no i am telling you like um, although the emotions i have my stupidity from shia religion my emotions the way i was brought up can't be like jiddu krishna murti or some seasoned indians a uh, very educated wise indians even my friend was better than a lot of muslims in london a hindu you know the friend gave me a lot of uh, the muslim friend in pakistan she gave me a lot of trouble oh when i found this uh, hindu friend in london i was like oh my god i this is the soulmate of mine because you know we don't taunt people we don't put the, each other down uh, we don't uh, we understand that if we look at the two years with me i mean in the first year i was not close to her second year i became close so i had three years of llb honors right in london two years with me and she could like don't be hard on yourself and she could see but zara you uh, your upbringing and all this right and this friend was judging me and bringing in my religion indirectly saying things you know what this hindu lady said my friend young lady young lady she was younger than me she said why not i told her about i was i would told her about hafiz shirazi his life he was in a 40 day in a chilla for you know all this uh, whatever he wanted or the truth seeker she said yeah, she, but she said it in such a way that i was like i don't feel like she's proud or that i can do it and you can't do it or you know god just gave me this great thing of being like i got myself out of it and uh, god knows what's wrong with you like that subliminal message that i got out of this and <laughs> no no her her way like i was telling her that you know i don't know if i can do this but when i can't explain uh explain this uh, oh god now my has uh, connected somehow with the speakers have to bring the speaker near some funny thing happening here yeah the speaker it got uh, so after sorry funny phone is getting funny on me my good phone um so so now my distraction and uh very good thing. like I, she didn't have that in her heart i could see and she would say one word and it would be enough for me like you know all the giving lectures and prep talks and i should work and this and that as a <laughs> i don't know what kind of a person i got from pakistan but from canada kismat hai si No, no, I should not blame it on my kismat, but I did feel unlucky, and uh, I was very unlucky. I felt it. Uh, bad luck following me. Uh, I don't know. I don't want people to feel sorry for me or anything. <coughs> Even now, I'm very unlucky on YouTube. 
but maybe that's a good thing for protecting me. They're protecting me. So one, um, yeah, did I say one Indian man requested me on Zafar Heretic? He had an Indian name. He requested me that if this is my true picture and all this, uh, things like that. So I shouldn't keep my any picture on YouTube at least, but you see what happened is for my case, I had to take some names and I had to come out with my real name. But now perhaps it's the time I could listen to this great gentleman who requested that I change my picture. Even if it's, uh, my, uh, you know, someone else's, because then if I put someone else's picture, they could go after that poor innocent lady. Because these Muslims, kuch aise hote hai na, for, to protect, don't say anything to Prophet Muhammad. You are either, they can call you bad words, prostitute, they have. And uh, one Tariq Masood even threatened me that, come to Pakistan and see what I do with you. In Urdu he was saying it. So... Now I can't even go to Pakistan. Anyways, the Pakistani visa uh, was difficult for me to get years back. And uh, so these things happening. So where am I going? My mind is not uh, orderly. Okay. Uh, Stealer stealing and I don't know if you ask me then why would Prophet Muhammad put his family in this he didn't he actually wanted good for them and the curse thing well maybe they have some protection even though they, they they must have seen like I was wondering in my case like how come they have no fear of God but they tell other people have fear of God this very very common in our societies, Muslim societies, very hypocritical. I mean, can you believe it? It's not zulm hota hai. Pakistan ka example agar aap lehen, musalman kehte hain apne aap ko. Aap phir kya karte hain? Dousron pe zulm karte hain? Kaise dek sakte hain ki ek beggar bhaar? Aur aaj kal kya ho gaya tha? Pakistan mein aisa hua tha. Sorry, I'm speaking in Urdu. Because this, this really doesn't, this is not for the Europeans or Amer Americans. This is for the, these Muslims. And I wonder if uh, the, Engl the, the Saudi Arabia and all <coughs> Arab countries, they know English. Maybe Syria, they don't know English. Turkey, uh, oh, sorry, they don't know Urdu. Other part of Urdu has come from Turkey, Turkish language. Anyways. So what was I saying is that this is, sorry English speaking friends and people out there in Pakistan. So now you know, can you see this? Why these people, like I used to wonder, superficially, not I, takbir, Allah Akbar, not I, risalat. Ya Rasulullah, sallallahu alayhi wa alayhi wa sallam. Islam is the best, east or west, and all this. And then you're seeing beggars and all this. Kaun sa khawf hai khuda ka? Acha, gang rapes ho rahe hain. Ek aurat de rahi hai. Medicine. Jude bol rahi hai. Dr. Farooq Ziyamad. You know who she is. Siala gave a free land for her pioneer in uh, clinical psychology, Dr. Farooq Siyamad. And what is happening in Pakistan? Mein? So I used to wonder, ke ye people, are they, what kind of people are they? One thing I get so angry about is, Allah and Rasulullah will take the name of the Lord, the Lord will go to the Lord, the Lord will go to the Lord. हमें नमाज पढ़नी है अच्छा वो पागलपन कर रहे हैं पागलपन ऐसा विकेट 
करप्शन कोर्ट्स में करप्शन के प्रेसिडेंट मुशर्रफ उस टाइम पे जो प्रेजिडेंट मुशर्रफ मिस्टर मुशर्रफ प्रेसिडेंट था ना परवेज मुशर्रफ कोर्ट को हिला हिला कर बिकॉज सो मेनी जजेस सब करप्शन हैड टू टू करप्शन अच्छा नमाज आएगी नमाज पे जाएंगे अजान होगी सॉरी अजान होगी नमाज पे चले जाएंगे सीधा नमा जा नमाज पे हमें नमाज पढ़नी है अरे उधर तारिक रोड पे अभी तो कह रहे थे रेप हो रहा है प्रेग्नेंट वेमेन उधर अस्करी अपार्टमेंट्स नहीं है उधर रेस कोर्स के उधर आगे सब मरीन का राउंड अबाउट उधर क्लिफ्टन ये डिफेंस एरिया ये इधर जो भी एरिया है उधर जो फिर गाजी पे जाते हैं उससे पहले ये क्या था प्रेग्नेंट वेमेन बच्चे हाथों में बैगिंग डे टाइम नाइट टाइम एक दफ़ा नाइट टाइम आई वी आर गोइंग फॉर मदरस लेडी के बैगिंग मेरे फादर ने कहा ये क्या है इधर वट इज दिस सर यू सी इट सुपरफिशली आर्टिफिशली तो ये इनके रसूल ने कहा किया है ना तो ये तो बेहद करना इनको तो एक यानी बहाना चाहिए इन मुसलमानों को ऐसे इनको तो एक बहाना चाहिए ये कोई सही मुसलमान नहीं है और वैसे भी सही मुसलमान अब क्या है क्या बचा है जब मैं डीप गई हूँ देखा है हाँ लेकिन हमारे लिए शिया लोगों के लिए और कुछ सुनी मॉडरेट के लिए कि पीस तुम लोगों को सबको बेवकूफ़ बनाया इवन शियाज तुम लोगों को बेवकूफ़ बनाया या हम बेवकूफ़ बन गए हैं देखें लैंड होम्स सब कुछ ले लिया प्रॉमिस अल्लाह इज प्रॉमिस कि यू विल इनहेरिट इवन लैंड्स दैट यू हैव नॉट ड्रॉडन ऑन द इस्लाम इज स्प्रेड लाइक फायर और ये पहले तो डर था आई अपील टू द अरब वर्ल्ड कुछ ऐसे ये शुक्र है सर प्रिंस सलमान निकले हैं क्राउन प्रिंस ओ सॉरी प्रिंस सलमान किंग सलमान हैं वो सॉरी अब आदस मोहम्मद बिन सलमान वो अंग्रेज़ उनको एम वो देते हैं ना तो मैं भूल जाती हूँ मोहम्मद बिन सलमान इनिशल से पुकारते हैं राइटिंग तो हिज हिज क्राउन प्रिंस मोहम्मद बिन सलमान मॉडरेशन जब से किंग अब्दुल्ला तो मैंने तो बोला तो किंग अब्दुल्ला ने मेरे अगेंस्ट कुछ बोला तो आ, पता चला कि उस टाइम पे कि अरब वर्ल्ड में एकेडमिक शिया सुनी बैठे हैं टेबल पे बैठे हैं ऐसे नहीं कि जाएं और मारें एक दूसरे को टका टक टक और बेहदिंग करें और लिंचिंग करें फिर मशाल ख़ान का सुना जो पाकिस्तान में हुआ था फर्स्ट केस जो हमने सुना जो रिपोर्टेड केस पता नहीं कितने मर गए हैं कोई अनरिपोर्टेड केसेस है कोई रिपोर्ट नहीं करता है तो वो रिपोर्टेड केस था वो ये पाकिस्तान में जो हो रहा है वो ये तो सऊदी अरेबिया भी इनसे आई थिंक अभी अलकायदा और ये वो रियली really, पता नहीं अभी ये क्रैक डाउन है इधर यूएई में मैं आई तो सुना कि ब्रदरहुड का क्रैक डाउन है पता नहीं कौन सा सुन्नी मुस्लिम का वो एरिया है मेरा एरिया नहीं है वट इज़ दिस ब्रदर इस, brother, इस आ, आ, अरब पूल वो क्या होता है पता नहीं क्या पूल है क्या है उसको बुलाते हैं किस नाम से और ब्रदरहुड ये तो यूएई भी इसके अगेंस्ट थी ब्रदरहुड के जो हमें बताया था पता चला न्यूज़ में क्रैक डाउन ऑन मुस्लिम ब्रदरहुड और एक मुस्लिम पूल होते वो पानी ऐसा कुछ ऐसा नाम है मुझे पता नहीं है समथिंग लाइक दैस स्विमिंग मुझे स्विमिंग याद आ रही है स्वान जो भी था वो है सॉरी मैं ऐसी हूँ टूटी फूटी उर्दू में बात कर लेती हूँ इंग्लिश ब्रोकन इंग्लिश में बात कर लेती हूँ लेकिन मैसेज पहुँच जाए मेरा बस 
تو اب تھوڑا ڈیٹیل میں میں پھر بعد میں جاؤں گی دیکھیں تو آپ کہیں گے کاش میرے پاس حوصلہ ہوتا ابھی میں اٹیک بھی ہوئی ہوں اور تھوڑا ریسٹلیسنیس ہے کھایا بھی نہیں ہے صرف اسٹمک بھی گرول کر رہا ہے یہ بھی پرابلمس ہو رہے ہیں ہاں سو آئی ہیٹ مائی ہیڈ ایک پل آن این ایم ٹی اسٹمک دس وائل دس پرابلمس ہیم ہیونگ سوری اباؤٹ دس بٹ آئی جسٹ شو یو جیسے امام رضا کے ادھر میں گئی تھی نا جعفر صادق آن ایگزٹینس آف گاڈ تھوڑا میرے شیعہ دیکھ لیں دیکھیں یہ بالکل غلط ہے ابھی میں نے یوٹیوب لائیو بھی کیا تھا ادھر بھی لاسٹ ویڈیو میں میں تھوڑا آگے بھی گئی تھی فیئر دیکھیں یہ لگتا ہے سفر ہیرکٹک کا پلیز آپ سنیں تو وٹ آل ڈو از آئی ایم ہیونگ سم ہاں آل ٹیک اے بریک آئی وانٹ پوز دس آل اپلوڈ دس ویڈیو سوری آئی پرامس نو آئی ڈنٹ پرامس آئی واز جسٹ گوئنگ ٹو آئی واز تھنکنگ آف گوئنگ ٹو جعفر صاد جعفر صادق آن دس لیٹ می سی اف آئی کین ہولڈ مائی سیلف تو کیا ہے ایگزٹینس آف گاڈ ادھر آپ دیکھیں پہلی چیز فیئر آئی نا تو آئی ہیو مینشن دس ان انگلش یہ ایسا ہونا نہیں چاہیے ایگزٹینس آف گاڈ اب کچھ شیعہ بھی ایسے ہیں نا میں نے ایکسپیرینس کیا ہے وہ اپنے پرسنل اس پہ کہ اس کو یہ آیا اس کو ہارم کرو جیسے کوئی تھی نانی دادی یہ وہ وہ اپنے پرسنل اس پہ اور کوئی زیادہ اور کوئی عالم نہیں ہے جو دیکھ کے بچوں کا خیال علامہ رشید رابی نے تو دعا کی تھی بٹ ناؤ آئی تھنک اٹ واز مائی مدرس دیوی اور مائی مدرس آنٹس دیوی ہو ہیلپ اینڈ آئی سروائو ان دس ٹیربل فیملی ویری ویری کرون نان اسٹاپ نان اسٹاپ بچوں کو بھی نہیں چھوڑتا ہوں یہ فیملی کسی کے اپنے بچوں کے ساتھ تو بہت اچھے ہیں جیسے جیسس کرائسٹ ایز سائڈ رائٹ ایز بیٹ ایز یو آر یو نو ہاؤ ٹو گیو گڈ تھنگس ٹو یور چلڈرین تو یہ تو میرے باپ کی فیملی کی ایگزامپل سوری اف یو تھنک آئی ایم گاسپنگ ہاں اور ایک تو اگر آپ گاسپ کرنا چاہ رہے ہیں تو نہیں بالکل بھی میرے طرف سے اجازت میں نہیں دے رہی ہوں آئی کنڈیم اٹ پھر دیکھیں آپ کہیں گے کہ پریچر ہے نہیں میرا کیس ہے اگر آپ دیکھیں میں اس فیملی پہ اگر وہ لاؤں کورٹ میں لے کے جاؤں کیس لاؤں کچھ ایسا ہونا چاہیے نا کہ عالم بیٹھیں شیعہ عالم آئیں بیٹھیں اور ان کے ساتھ بات کریں کہ یہ کیا ہے تم لوگ بچوں کو نہیں چھوڑتے ہو یہ تو یہ تبھی یہ ایک ہماری اف آئی کڈ مینشن ہر نیم شیعہ تھی وہ ذاکرہ بنی تھی آئی ہیو نون ہر فرام یا مائی فادرس فیملی سائڈ بٹ یہ پاکستانی انڈیا نا پاکستانی ہے تو وہ نا کہہ رہی تھی کہ یہ ہنازہ ہنازہ کیا سورہ ہنازہ کون سا سورہ ہے کہ اگر آپ لوگ کو بہت وہ کریں گے نا ٹانٹنگ اور یہ وہ تو ہو سکتا ہے کہ وہ پیچھے آپ کے بات کرنے لگے ہیں تو میں نے تو وہ سورہ پڑھا مجھے کچھ ایسا نظر نہیں آیا آئی ایم ٹرائنگ ٹو سرچ فار اٹ ایک ہے سورہ اس نے نام بھی دیا تھا ڈیفینس امام بارگاہ میں پڑھتی تھی اس کا لاسٹ خالی نام میں بتا سکتی ہوں حسن مریم پلیز ارو تو وہ تو شیعہ ہیں شیعہ ذاکرہ بن گئی ان کی آواز بہت اچھی ہے وہ شادی میں اپنے ہی ریلیٹو کی شادی میں انہوں نے گایا تھا گانا دکھائی دی ایک یوں کہ بے خود کیا ہمیں آپ سے بھی جدا کر چلے ان کی آواز بہت اچھی ہے مریم حسن ہے وہ ڈیفینس امام بارگاہ میں بھی پڑھے پڑھی ہے انہوں نے مجلس سے پڑھی ہیں تو اب ہم ادھر آ ہیں 
तो अब मैं वो इधर क्रोम अच्छा ओपन इन क्रोम तो मैं दूसरा भी टैब खोल सकती हूँ इधर आई कैन ओपन अनदर टैब तो वो पता नहीं सूर्य हंजा तो ये जो इस पर ना हमाजा अच्छा सूर्य हमाजा है लाइक आप किसी पे ना ऐसा जुल्म जो वो जुल्म नहीं फिज़िकल नहीं लेकिन वो एक जुल्म होता है जो आप उसे टॉन्ट कर रहे हैं कभी कॉन्डिसेंडिंग वे में वो टू एवरी बैक बाइट और सिलेंडर हाँ तो ये समझा रही थी ये कि अगर आप जैसे फिर उस उस साइड पे भी जा रही थी शी वॉज़ वेरी वाइज थैंक गुडनेस अच्छा इधर है वो टू एवरी बैक बाइट और सिलेंडर सूर्य हमाजा द ट्रोड्यूसर तो वो कह रही थी कि अच्छा वो चाह रही थी एक्सप्लेन करे जो मुझे समझ में नहीं कि कभी कभी ऐसा भी तो होता है ना कि लोग कंप्लेन करते हैं तो अगर आप उनको पुश तो एक्चुअली मैं मुझे द वे आई टू गेट मे बी वो तो आ, तो देखें थैंक गॉड सो मरियम हसन थैंक यू सो मच वंस आई मे बी आई मिस तो मुझे ऐसा लग रहा था कि वो कह रही थी कि ऐसे भी लोग होते वो लोग उनको नहीं कह सकते बैग बाइटर्स एंड सिलेंडर्स जैसे आपने किसी को टॉन्ट तो हमारे शिया देखें शिया ओह तो यानी मरियम हसन मलियानी बनी ना तो कह रही थी कि उनको आप नहीं कह सकते बैग बाइटर्स किन को एक क्लास ऑफ पीपल होते हैं जिनको आप जो हमेशा जिनको आप कहते हैं लाइक यू स्नब दैम यू डोंट लिसन टू दैम तो वो भी रिपेलियस हो सकते हैं पीछे फिर बात फिर उनको कोई जगह तो ये आप देखें ओह शी एक्सप्लेन खलील जिब्रान जैसे कहते हैं ना कि बिफोर वेइंग द हजबेंड द वुमन्स बिट्रेल वे द हजबेंड हार्ट के वो ऐसे सोल एंड हार्ट <coughs> oh, oh, oh. देखा अब आई एम सो इमोशनल तो ये जो वो टू एवरी अच्छा अब तो इसको भी दिखाना होगा ये प्रॉफिट मोहम्मद को मैं आपको ऐसा एक्सपोज करूँगी इसको बिकॉज मेरा अब आई यू नो वी कुडेंट उस तरफ से डिसबिलीवर्स को मारो मार के मार दो दे दरा दर मारो hmm. हिपोक्रेट्स वो हैं डिसबिलीवर्स हैं ये वो वो टू एवरी बैग सच कहा मरियम हसन ने और द वे आई टू कर मजलिस वॉज दैट ये बात नहीं है कि कोई पीछे जाके बोलता है कि मेरे बाप ने मुझे मारा अब जैसे मैं कर रही हूँ ना इधर कि मेरे बाप की फैमिली इसकी फैमिली वो लोग ऐसे हैं तो दीज आर नॉट बैग बाइटर्स एंड सेंटर जैसे मैं अभी आपको दिखाऊँगी कि प्रॉफिट मोहम्मद कैसा सच सच एक्सपोज करूंगी मैं प्रॉफिट मोहम्मद है उसकी आल को भी प्रॉफिट का आल को भी मैं एक्सपोज करूंगी तो एक तरफ से ये मुसलमान आ जाते हैं ऐसे इमोशनल खाम खाम के अगर इनको टाइम है पहले जाके कोई आप चैरिटी करें इधर भी अगर अरब्स कोई मुझ पर गुस्सा कर रहे हैं शिया कोई हो पहले जाके उसको ठीक करें ना जिसने मुझे इस मकाम पे लाया है कि मैं ये करूं तो कॉज को देखें कॉज को देखें इफेक्ट को नहीं देखें इफेक्ट को आप बंद कर रहे हैं लेकिन कॉज को भी ज़रूर देखें तो ये मरियम अशो मरियम हसन एक्सप्लेन कर रही थी अपने मजलिस में डिफेंस इमाम बारगा में एक दिन सूर्य हमाजा सो नॉट एवरी लाइक इफ समन इज़ कम्प्लेनिंग कि बाबा मेरा बाप मुझे वो कर रहा है या मेरा अंकल मुझे बैड थिंग्स डूइंग बैड थिंग्स डूइंग तो उसको आप वो नहीं करें बराबर आप तहकीक़त करें रिसर्च वो एविडेंस के लिए क्या बोलते हैं सोसाइटी <coughs> में कितने बैग बाइटर्स और ये वो ये चीज़ें अब हमें बंद करनी है और बच्चों को टॉन्ट करना और बच्चों को स्नैप करना और बच यू नो चिल्ड्रेन ग्रो अप तो ये बच्चे जब कंप्लेन करते हैं आप एक्चुअली पेविंग वे कर रहे हैं इनके लिए 
یہ خود جو بیک بائٹرز آف سینٹرز ہیں تو یہ دیکھیں یہ محمد نے کیسے لکھا ہے اچھا آپ نے آپ کو پروٹیکٹ کر لیا نا کہ کوئی اس کے بارے میں کوئی ایگزامن ہی نہیں کرے اس کی لائف کہ یہ اچھا ہے خراب ہے پاسل آف اللہ ہے کہ نہیں ہے جھوٹ ہم سے بول رہا ہے کہ نہیں اتنے چالہ کے سے کیا ہے کہ مجھے اپنا میرا بلڈ یعنی بالکل خشک ہو گیا ہے ڈرائی اس کو اور اس کے حال کو ایکسپوز کرنے کے لیے اچھا پتہ نہیں کہاں کہاں سے لیا ہے یہ آیتیں یہ کیا خدا نے بھیجا ہے اس کا ڈس بلیورس آئیڈل ورشپرس ان کا تو آپ نے پورا ختم کر دیا ایک وسپر تک نہیں رہا شکر ہے ایک وسپر آیا ہے ابن ساق وہ بھی کہتے ہیں ہمیں کہ نہیں لو بنی کریزا کا وسپر آیا تو کہا نہیں لو یہ غلط ہے یہ ایک انسان سے آیا ہے ان کے بکس ختم کر دیے آئیڈل ورشپرس کے ہاؤس آف گاڈ بھی ان کا ختم کر دیا سیکریڈ ہاؤس ان کا ختم کر دیا ان کے جو یہ جڑی بوٹیوں کے ہربس کہ وہ ہوتے تھے نا کہ اب آیور ویدا اور یہ وہ بھی سب ختم کر دیا ہوگا مکہ میں آئیڈل ورشپ پیگن جہاں بھی اور یہ مکہ تو یہ کہتے ہیں یہ انگریزوں نے صحیح طرح امیریکنس نے اور مل کے دیکھ رہے ہیں کہ یہ تو مکہ میں تھا ہی نہیں یہ سب ایبسائڈس نے بنایا ہے یہ فیک ہے یہ سیکریٹ ہاؤس ہی نہیں ہے اور مکہ میں کیسے ہو سکتا ہے مدینہ میں اتنا وہ فلرشنگ گارڈن ان میں یہ فیکٹس دیکھتے ہیں یہ فیکٹس دیکھتے ہیں یہ یورپینز امیریکنس ہمارے انفارچونیٹلی آئی ایم فیل سو اشیمڈ کہ ہمارے ریلیجیس اسکالرس پریجڈس ہو گئے تھے وہ بھی بلائنڈیڈ محمد کے بھی یہ یہ جو فیئر دیا ہے آپ کی لائف لمیٹیڈ ڈل آپ کو ہمیشہ بات بات پہ آپ ویسٹرنرس کو ہم نے کوئی سلیو لیس پہنا تو اس پہ بات کریں گے یہ بات کریں گے بات بات پہ آپ بولیں گے لیکن گندگی جو ہمارے مسلمان ملک میں ہے وہ چل رہی ہے نیرو مائنڈنس یہ اس کو نیرو مائنڈنس جو کہتے ہیں اس کو آپ جج کریں گے بہت بات بات پہ آن ایوری تھنگ یو ول ویل بی ججنگ اینڈ وی ہیو بن ججنگ اپنا ٹھیک کرو اپنا ٹھیک کرو اپنا ملک ٹھیک کرو اس چیز سے نکلو یہ آگ سے اچھا دیکھو میں آپ کو ڈرانا نہیں چاہتی ہوں لیکن ایک بات کہہ رہی ہوں کہ یہ جہنم کے آگ سے یہ بتر یہ جھوٹ یہ لوگوں کو ڈرانا اور اسلام میں لانا اور اب میں دکھاؤں گی لیٹر آن لیٹر ویڈیو میں کہ پھر سے میں جاؤں گی ڈیٹیل میں امام جعفر صاحب ویر ایور آئی کین ریچ امام جعفر صاحب دیکھنے بھی کیسے کیسے ڈرایا ہے اور کیسا اسٹوپڈ بنایا اس کو فزیشین ہندو فزیشین یہ امام رضا ڈاٹ نیٹ پہ ہے ایگزٹنس آف گاڈ جعفر صادس میں آپ کو دکھاؤں گی تو پھر آپ کے لیے آسان کروں گی شیاؤں کے لیے کہ دیکھیں اور ہٹے لیو دس ریلیجن سیک فائر اٹس ورس دین دا اٹرنل فائر دیر از نو اٹرنل فائر مجھے کہہ رہے ہیں مجھے ایک ہیلپ مل رہی ہے مجھے میری آنٹی نے کہا تھا فال نکال کے کہ تمہیں اور پرنسپل کو غیبی مدد ملے گی انسین ہیلپ شاید وہی ہے ایک ایک کہیں سے خدا سچائی وہ جو چیز میرے اندر تھی نا کچھ غلط لگ رہا ہے ادھر کافی پڑھوں اور کافی کھلے نہیں کی تو نیریشنز آف آئی مم بعد میں کچھ ادھر غلط لگ رہا ہے کچھ قرآن میں غلط لگ رہا ہے کچھ امام حسین کے ادھر بھی کربلا میں غلط لگ رہا ہے ایسا ہونے لگا تھا مجھے بٹ آئی یوز ٹو اوائڈ دیٹ وائس ٹرائی ٹو نو نا پھر یہ کیوں ادھر کرس ہے پھر ان پہ کیوں کرس ہوگا پھر یہ تو خدا کا خوف کرتے ہیں تو میں آپ کو دکھاؤں گی پھر 
दूसरे वीडियो में कंटिन्यू लेटर होपफुली लेट्स सी वेन आई कैन डू दिस सो थैंक यू सो मच आई हैव टू गो नाउ आई कंटिन्यू लेटर